Give her quite a lot, and of course we will see that in the women's game tomorrow afternoon here at Stamford Bridge as well as Chelsea take on Spurs in the WSL. But for now, we are focused on this under-18s Premier League encounter, and it's an early sign of Tudor mendel -Ado. We know how good he can be on the ball. Straight back to score goals, but they weren't always so well balanced as they are these days. Good chance early, but really well defended by mendel -Ado as, as Tottenham try and build something. You're absolutely right, and he does feel hurt there by the leg that was left in by Olesesi. Quickly back off on his feet and Chelsea continue. It's lovely feet from Mendel Ado. Speak about that moment of magic. This is very much a man that can produce that. And we've seen that already this season. Brilliant play there from Michael Golden as well to force it. And there is one of the millions of reasons, Clive White. You played at such a high level and I'm sat beside you talking about it. But here's a chance for Mendel Ado. One or two question marks maybe about... One or two question marks maybe about a, a penalty there, but ignored. Absolutely. Akamiya around the captain's armband this morning into Mendel Adou. It's good ball. Go forward. Final 60 seconds of the half. Oh, it's lovely feet from Tudor Mendel Adou. He skips past three or four and wins a throw in for Chelsea. And he's got some quick feet, hasn't he? Goes with his turn of pace as well. Obviously a player to keep an eye on for the future. I know it gets mentioned quite a lot, but he's a quick mind as well. Extremely intelligent, extremely intelligent off the pitch. Which I know is, is no longer a, a, a rarity. Not that I'm saying they, they weren't in your day, Clive. But what are you trying to say? <laughs> to step in front of McKnight. And the though could be free here. He's got space to run into. He's got Flower at the far post and McMahon, who's offering an option in, in the box as well. He's in the corner. Yeah, again. Akamiya can make it now between Mendelado and Achiampong. There's a bit of space down this right hand side. He instead elects to cut across field and give it to Boniface on the far side. Strike on the half hour. Here he is in possession. Caught by Jamie Donnelly, but here's Tudor Mendelado. Inside to Achiampong. Golden looking to thread it and back to run him. Just the, the face of the game. Do they change formation? Or is it just a question of like for like? This afternoon, I'm sure we've got fresh legs as well. Different style as well, so it can make a difference. I mean, the Lado, lovely bit of trickery there. It's Achiampong. Opens up onto his left foot. What a strong, oh. what a goal that is from Josh Achiampong. Champion, and he just lets rip. What a finish! Good skills initially, wasn't it? But look at the space he's been afforded. And that's uh, Mendel Ado who drags defenders over one way, brings it back the other. But I'll tell you what. It's giving Chelsea the lead. Here is McNeely. Here's his bonnet face on the left hand side. It's a hung up cross towards Mendel Ado. It's a really good save for a second there as well, Clive. I thought maybe there was a leg that was hung out and. It's going to bring Boniface down. He, he did really well. Yeah, it could have done, but eventually he gets into good possession, position, doesn't he, to make the delivery. Steps over here. Is that just inside or outside the box? But this is a great ball. Good position, Mendel Ado.